I'm putting up this stone wall here. And here's the rock pile that I'm choosing from. Now it would be it would be nice if I could just find all the pieces that I need to fit precisely. But that's not the case. There's times when you have to cut them to the size that you need. And I'm sure there's many ways to do it. But the way that I've been cutting them is to use a chisel and um, to cut I use a chisel on the the facing side because a chisel look just looks a lot better than a cut look this is the exposed side and then the other three sides I use a uh, a grinding tool with a diamond cutter on it to cut they cut those three sides and then I use a chisel to to break it off. And that seems to work the best. I've uh, tried a lot of different ways and that just happens to work best for me. Now for, you can see I'm fitting the pieces in right here and I use a piece of half inch plywood for my gap. That's where the uh, cement will go. So I can put the rock here and see how it's going to fit before I cement it in. So this piece right here, it's a, let me get my measuring tape here. It's about you know, six and, it's about six and three quarters high. I want to go all the way up to that line. And then I want to have it, you know, go from here to about, Right here, right here in the middle, or somewhere around there. So let's measure that. And I need a little more there. Uh, about 18, 19 inches. So here's the, here's the stone, the rock, which is about six and three quarters and then so we're gonna split it right here right there to cut the stone I uh, I made this box it's only uh, 24 inches by 24 inches and then I uh, I have plywood on the bottom of it three-quarter inch plywood and then uh, two by twos. Actually they look a little bit smaller but anyway then I filled it up with sand and that absorbs the uh, the shock of when I'm whacking it with a sledgehammer and chisel. So anyway there's the stone I'm gonna cut. I'm gonna mark it and then we're gonna chisel the uh, face side which is the side that's facing up and then I'm going to uh, cut the other three sides with the uh, four and a half inch grinder with the uh, diamond blade on it. Mark that there. Looks pretty good. Okay. I'm gonna pile that sand under here to absorb that shock. Alright, there we go. 
going to chisel the uh, face side, the side that's going to show when I put it up on the wall. Make sure you wear safety glasses for this because these chips go flying. For cutting the other three sides, I like to wear safety glasses, uh, a full face mask, hearing protection, There you go. Here's our piece that we'll use. Again, I like to just saw these three sides that won't show. And this side will be the piece that shows. So using a chisel just gives it a, well, a better look you know, when it's put up on the wall. And there it is. Before I cement it in. And exactly the uh, the fit that I want to have. I just finished cementing those stones in. And there's the uh, stone I had cut. So you can see how it looks once the uh, cement is in there. <laughs> 